How you get so much favor on your side? Accept the measure, Lord, and save I just want to share one thing that literally changed my life. And um, I was going to this church in Vegas, um, Mountaintop Faith Ministries. And I don't know if it's, it was part of a sermon or if it, if it was the first lady just speaking, but it was everything I needed to hear because at the time I had just, it was a, maybe I was a few years removed from college and I started going to the church in college here and there. Didn't have a prayer life, nothing. Um, I thought being a good Christian or, or just doing what I was supposed to do was going to church every Sunday. Um, when I finally understood the power of tithing, tithing, I thought, you know, I go to church, I tithe, I'm good, right? I'm going to heaven, you know, you know, all is well. But she mentioned how important it was to know God for yourself, to hear his voice, um, to have a prayer life, to read about. And I was like, wait, hear his voice. Wait, God speaks? Like how? Like what? It was foreign to me. I had no idea. She talked about praying for yourself. I literally thought, I literally thought, because how, how else was I supposed to know, right? I literally thought that you go to church, the, the, the pastor prays over you. He says the word that always spoke to my situation every Sunday. And I was good, you know? No, I was like, oh wait, I have to pray? Like, how do I do that? And then I started writing my prayers and got a Bible and eventually started reading it and like, and, and learning his voice and sometimes getting it wrong. And, and I say all that to say is it's so important that we um, start <laughs> picking apart the Bible and stop picking apart sermons. Stop picking apart people's ministries. Like, Lord, get to know God. Get to know him for yourself. Get to know him for yourself so you don't have to go to people for a word. Like, God's trying to talk to you. Yes, he uses our pastors and ministers and evangelists and prophets and apostles to talk to us. Yes, but they should not be the primary source of the word God is trying to get to you you need to get the word from god for yourself through the bible through prayer and then you use church pastors all those people i just mentioned as confirmation off of what god already told you for yourself Come again.